Good morning, everybody. This is a VR to Josh at Pipe Up North. A ways north of me here in Minnesota. Anyway, uh, congrats on your 25,000 views. And almost 500 subscribers, I believe. Um, anyway, what I collected as a child and what I still collect now. Uh, when I was a kid in Redwood Falls back in the mid-60s to early 70s, we played marbles a lot. And we played for keeps, and, well, I still got all my marbles. I haven't lost them all. <laughs> and uh, I've added more to my collection, but I'll just show you a few of them. I don't even know what kind of tin this is, but. It's an old coffee can, anyway. Here's some. I don't. Yeah, I always like marbles. I got I have do have a lot more than these. Oh, it's a uh, Chase in Sanborn. Chase in Sanborn coffee tin. Here's another one. This is a newer tin, but anyway, I got a lot of my shooters in here. I also do have a few clay marbles, too, that I did. Those I got at auctions and stuff, and I've sold them here and there. And I do have a few left, but not, not a whole lot. And here's my another one, just in a plastic. Some more shooters. Little size difference. These are regular ones. These are the shooters. So yeah, that's what I still collect. I get. I've gotten bought and some out at Pioneer Power and um yeah I still have the original marble bags my one I used all the time was uh it was a red one with like white polka dots I still have it I don't re recall where I put it at the moment but I still got it <laughs> 
I didn't lose them. Anyway, congratulations, congratulations, Josh. Um, then, yeah, marbles is what I collected when I was four or five years old and up to now. And then I, I will say, when we moved to Henderson in 72, then first thing I asked was, well, do you guys play marbles or uh, no? <laughs> so I was like, yeah, that was the end of my playing marble days. But anyway, hope you all have a good day. Be humble, be kind, and love yourself. Have a great day.